So today's video is going to be about my vendor event that I did last week, Saturday. I want to say that date was like 9, 10, 21, right? I think it was. But nonetheless, I did a vendor event, my first vendor event um, in many, many years. So let's just say my first vendor event. Um, and I did it and I want to say it was the best thing ever. Um, so the event I did was through the Colleen Sister Cities. Um, it's a location, it's a organization where I live. Um, so I did not know what to expect going into this. I also did not know what the event was when I was asked to do the event. So fast, rewind. A uh, sensei sister of mine had texted me. I got home from visiting my daughter Monday morning. She texted me Tuesday evening and was like, hey, can you take this event? And I was like, let me check. So I checked and I was like, sure, I can do it. Um, she told me all I needed to do. She sent me all the information. She told them that, hey, the vendor like person is changing, but you still will have a sensei person, which was me. So fast forward, I package, make, create all the things that I need to do for this event. Keep in mind, I was already signed up for an event on Halloween. We'll talk about that one in another video, but I was already set up for an event on Halloween, but I have a lot of stuff to sell as you already know. So for me, I just took my grand total of everything and I broke it down in half of what I was going to take to this event and what I wasn't going to take. Um, so that's what I did. The day of the event, um, I could have set up the day before, which would have been Friday night. I set up, I set up, sorry, Saturday morning. So the day of the event was when I set up my table. Easy peasy, beautiful cover girl. It was fine. We got the table set up. I ran to Walmart because I realized I didn't have a tablecloth which is weird, but whatever. So I ran to Walmart. I needed a tablecloth, got the tablecloth, reset the table. It wasn't chaotic. In my mind though, I need things to run super smooth like butter, right? So there was a little bump in the road without having a tablecloth. So we have to get a tablecloth, blah, blah, blah. It was fine. Like in my head, I was panicking, but it was fine. Everything was fine. I had a blast. Things that I have learned from doing this vendor event. One, the things you don't bring are gonna be the things that people ask for. For example, someone asked me for oil. I have oil, didn't bring it, we know better for next time. Someone asked for pods and mini fans or those type of devices, didn't bring it, no better for next time. Um, I didn't bring all of the things and I'm not going to ever bring all of the things unless I know that I have a big enough space and I know the, the foot traffic. I had no idea what this event was going to be like. Was I nervous? Absolutely. Am I always nervous? Absolutely. Did it show? I don't think so. Um, the very first question I got asked, it was like, oh, so what's Sensi? I boldly told this dude, I don't know. But it was also the first person that I spoke to. He was really nice. We laughed. I got all my kinks out. He asked some really good questions. So one thing that I will tell you is if you are going to do vendor events, know your business. Like, know the history. Know why it started. Because he asked those questions. You're not going to get that all the time. But you also don't want to tell somebody, oh, I don't know. I'm a firm believer in telling people, I don't know. Let me go look it up. But he asked questions that I knew. So he asked questions like, how was Sensi started? La -da, 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 da Somebody asked me, well, do you love your business? And I was like, absolutely. If you don't love your business, you can say, no, I'm just doing this for some extra money. You can say whatever it is that you want to say, but I love my business. So that showed through and through the entire vendor event. Try not to do vendor events by yourself. You're going to have to go to the bathroom. You're going to want to eat. You can't leave your table in this vendor event. Try to do a, an event with somebody. Just get somebody, a friend, a sister, somebody who can help you when you need help. I have a buddy system. I talk to all the customers. My wife does the checkout. So I helped. I made some things that I'll put in another video that I made some things for her to make a smoother checkout process. Um, would I do this event again? A hundred percent hands down. Absolutely. If the lady who I got the event from is not going to do it anymore, then I will do it for Sensi. 
if she's going to do it, obviously I won't do it for Sensi, but I will do it for something else. Um, what else? I learned so much about myself during this event. Um, I learned that I do know a lot more about this business than I thought I did for some odd reason. I learned that children know a lot about Sensi. Even if they don't know what it's called, they know a lot about Sensi. Children will get their parents to buy them things that they know that they don't need to have and they know that they don't need to want. They will get their parents to buy it. Um, heat. Oh my God. So it was so hot. I didn't realize. Yes, I live in Texas. I know. I didn't realize that it was going to get so hot so fast because it's been cold and it's been raining. Psyche Mike. I know for next time, I don't know what I'm going to do just yet because my next event, I'm going to be outside. So I don't think I'm going to have to worry about that. But my next indoor event, I don't care what time of the year it is. I'm going to try to see what I can do to keep my wax bars cold. Maybe I got to get ice packs. Maybe I got to get them little mini pool things. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Um, but I'm super excited for my next vendor event. Now, if you were at that event and you seen me, say hi. If you're going to be at my next vendor event, I'm going to be doing an event on Halloween. Find me on social media. I posted the flyer. I want to see you guys there. Um, I think that's it. I love that event. We're now swapping things out for my Halloween event. So love you guys. Peace.